I've got the AirPods Pros and the AirPods 3s, and I was ready to return these, and now I'm keeping them. What? Why? Welcome back to Weekly Waste of Time. My name is Jeff Landsman. On today's show, we are talking about the differences between the AirPods Pros and the AirPods 3, but we're not going to do this in a techie way. This is a non-tech, real-world review. I'm here to tell you why the AirPods 3s are a great product for a lot of people, but not all people, and I'll get to that later, and the AirPods Pros are a great product for a lot of people, but not all people. You see where I'm going here? Okay, so both of these devices are great if you have Apple devices. So if you're in the Apple ecosystem, you've got an iPhone, you've got a Mac, you've got an iPad, etc. These devices are great because you sync them once, so you basically, if you pair them once, and then they jump from device to device. Also, they are compact. Look how tiny, so tiny. You know, these new Beats Fit Pros came out recently, and the case is much bigger. The AirPods will pair with Android. They will pair with Windows. They are Bluetooth headphones. They have stuff in them that make them work better with Apple devices, but that doesn't mean you can't use them with other devices. A huge misconception. They are water resistant. They both have great uh, microphones in them. Uh, you can see a lot of people, if you watch TV at all, they're all using AirPods. And they include a feature called spatial audio. It's uniquely interesting. Yes, we've got this sort of uh, surround sound for music. Who cares? I, I've tried it a number of times. I keep trying to like it. I don't care about it. I don't really like it. Uh, but I do like the spatial audio for what I was just doing. So I had the earbuds in. I was doing some editing on my computer and I turned my head. I was watching the clip back and it locks the screen. So I'm listening and it feels like it's coming from here no matter where I tilt my head. That's spatial audio. Now, it works with some movies, it'll work with Netflix. It's really a huge feature that I think is in its infancy right now and promises to do great things in the future. But even right now, it's phenomenal. Uh, if you've updated to your latest versions on your computer and on your uh, on your iPhone, you will also get spatial audio and FaceTime, so you'll hear people in different parts of the room, and it's really fantastic. I, you know, it's a bonus feature. I wouldn't call it a needed feature. You see, they just kind of drop in, right? I just like kind of plop it in there, and it's there. And the sound quality is fantastic. It makes d never get a uh, set of AirPods ones or twos ever again. The sound on the AirPods 3, just in terms of quality versus the previous generation, is way better, way better. And the low end, the bass, sounds way better without jamming them in your ears. They're $179. You get six hours of listening time on these things and 30 hours total when you use the case. So the case is a charger as well. The case uses inductive charging, so you can plop it on um, a Qi charger, you know, one of those, and, and it'll charge that way. It's a lightning port. It uses the same cable as your phone, so if you have an iPhone. So those are the AirPods 3s. Now, uh, the huge advantage of the AirPods 3s is they just pop in, and they pop out, and you're done. And I just put them in the, yeah, there we go. Why not just get the AirPods 3s? Because the AirPods Pros are $249. That's $70 more. Well, this is what they look like. And I'm going to pop them in, and automatically, they are way sort of more comfortable. They kind of, like, are cozy. They fit in my ears. But I can hear myself talking now. Like, I've got that thing when you plug your ears and you hear yourself. Plug your ears right now and go and just talk or chew or do whatever you would normally do when you just experience your day. <laughs> That's what it's like to have AirPods Pros in. Now, do the Pros sound better than the AirPods 3s? Yeah. Yeah, they do, but they're not great for just leaving in. So why get the AirPods Pros? What would, why would, why bother? It sounds to me like, Jeff, you're switching over to the AirPods 3s and happy birthday, man. Like, good, it's good on you. No, no, I'm not, I'm not. There's a need for the AirPods Pros, not just because the sound quality is a little bit better. 
but there's one big reason to have them, and that is they have noise cancellation. There's a lot of noise in the room. It cancels it. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. The AirPods 3s do not because uh, of the way they're designed and because they want to upsell you, right? So is there value in the noise cancellation? Does it work well? Uh, yeah, <laughs> to both, yeah. Not only does it work well, it works great. There are situations where I need to shut the sound off, my dogs are barking, and I just put on the noise cancellation and you are in your own world. And so I would say this, if you had to buy only one pair, that would be your question. How badly do you need noise cancellation? Because these AirPods Pros go on sale often for like 199, 189 I've seen them for a couple times. These AirPods 3s are $179. So for 10 or $20 or $30 more, you might be able to get these. And if that's the case and you really want active noise cancellation, definitely go with the pros. Having said that, if you hate that plugged feeling, the AirPods 3s should not be dismissed. In preparation for this show, I really gave it a whirl and listened to a bunch of music and uh, tried to edit with them and did like a bunch of tasks that I would do on a day-to-day -day basis. My vote is if you could have only one and you don't care about noise cancellation, definitely check out the AirPods 3s. They are fantastic. If you're ready to wait for a sale, definitely get the AirPods Pros. They are both fantastic. They are so similar in what they do, but those are the differences. My name is Jeff Landsman. Check me out on Twitter. It's twitter.com slash Jeff Landsman. Don't like or subscribe. I don't, I don't, the whole thing is a waste of time.